um, went to uh, an auction uh, last week, and <clears throat> I don't know if you ever if you ever come across with this. Uh, got some, I got some new pants, but it has one of these, you know, those uh, security thingy, thingamajiggy in it. So um, I posted this online on Facebook on one of the groups that I belong to. And asked for their help. Uh, you know, they told me to go on YouTube, watch some videos on how to remove them, but nothing specific to this kind. So um, I see some people like just, I don't know, hammering them, breaking them, and I've seen that that some of these are the different things. Okay, it looks like this is if you break this. I can't see it. If you break this, it means that you might, you know, emit or send out a loud noise. And I don't want to break the, uh, you know, the, the garment. Um, but it looks like inside, I'm going to show you here in a little bit. I'm going to show you. Okay, inside of that, it looks like it's just, it's just a pin. And from my research, uh, those has a magnet, you know, with a... Um, strong magnet. What it does is just it lifts that little center, it's, um, that, that metal right in the center of that. That's what it does. It will, what it does is just the magnet will pick that up and it will actually release some kind of a mechanism inside of it. So this thing, this particular thing right here, this is I think what we use for like maybe Target or any, any go to Target store. Um, and if you break this seal, that's what would do is actually emit that loud noise. I don't know. And also some of these, I don't know if it, this one has it, but some of those has like, um, you know, it's explosive ink, you know? But I don't think this one would have it. But what I'm going to do is actually just, and it looks like, like I said, it's just like a little pin that's holding it in between, you know? So, and it looks like that pin right there, it will go through will actually uh, uh, it's just right right there it's pretty shallow that's what I think and what I'm gonna do is actually have my Ryobi drill I think this one would be better for that um, I think this one right here see what I'm gonna do is drill that into that and see if I can if I can release then hopefully there's no uh, wires in there that I will send a signal to this that it's just being tampered. So I think, and after that, I, you know, if it doesn't work with that, I'm just going to smash it with a hammer. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. But okay, let's so do it. Uh, what I did here is, you know, I found put some kind of protective thing. I actually have two pans that I got to do. So, like I said, I'm going to have to go ahead and drill it right here, and then I'm going to use a you know, handy dandy little thing. So, um, place this for now. Put it right here. Right. So, um, so what I can do, so, all right, right there. What I'm gonna do is like, I got one of this uh, lamp. I got like, like. What is this? 99 cents on Home Depot. Put them right over here, right, just right there, so I should be able to hold it. And um, I, have, I need something. Uh, you know, I'm gonna use this thing. Something sturdy. Put it right on the bottom. Right there. So, move it like that. So, just like that. Right. Ready? I think uh, the pin is just right over here, so it'll be just right there. Oh, it's pretty hollow. Hmm. All right. 
this one. It looks like there's a magnet right there. And it looks like the pin is just right about right there. See that? Right inside that, there's the, uh, the pin. But I think the pin will be lift up from there, I guess. So we'll see what it is. Damage the uh, hands in there. Yeah, I don't see any. I don't see the pin yet. Oh, continue on. So that was pretty. Pretty soft. Now, I'm gonna, there's a little pin right there. I'm going to see if I can push it. Okay, I think I'm going to need a little uh, magnet. Alright, so actually my, uh, my son said that he had a, a magnet. It's like a cylinder magnet, you know. And this would all actually work in some of them, but I don't know if it's going to work in here. So we'll, we'll, we'll try them out. So we'll put them right, right here and there's a magnet right over here. See? No, it's not working. So we'll continue breaking that. <laughs> Okay, so it looks like this is some type of metal right over here. Because when we put a magnet in there, the magnet sticks right over here. Right there. So what I'm going to do is, actually I'm going to drill that right over here. So we'll just, I'll, we'll see if I can be able to remove that. Just remove this metal right here. So here you go. All right, so it looks like there's a, a magnet. So I'm going to continue to drilling that and exposing those. Let's see if we can get any. 
Aha! There you go. What is this? Huh. The metal thing in there. Yeah. Okay. So what I'm gonna do, and I'm just gonna remove this little by little. Without damaging the garment. There. Ta-da! It is out. I did not damage anything, but it all got that little big fuzz in it. So, all right. So we have one more, and uh, what I'm going to do is do the same. I'm just going to drill it right over here. I don't need to actually remove the this thing. So once I get them. Uh, once I get exposed, keep the, the magnet. I, I don't think it's a magnet. See, it doesn't. It's just a me piece of metal. Mm, I, need to. I want it. You still. can keep that. So there you go. That's how you remove them. So you're not even damaging things. Like I said, you know, from here, if you gotta, you know, carefully drill it, or if you even have like maybe a Dremel tool, you just like right over here, right there. Uh, you know, because it's really soft. You can just dremel it and cut this piece right off and it'll come right off. So that's it. That's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs>